Hong Kong, it's geography time. I'm going to do some sporkle quizzes. It's uh, name the largest. Eight minutes? That sounds like a long time for this, but we'll try. Largest islands. That's not, that's not going to count, is it? Baffin Island. Borneo. Madagascar. Can't miss that. Oh, that's a really big one that I'm missing. <clears throat> Countries by forest area. Brazil. Gabon, I know, is like almost completely covered in, in forest. <laughs> Maybe total forest area. Oh, getting lots of bonuses. <laughs> That's nice. United States. United States. Another big forested country. What would it be like? Argentina. No. Um, most bordered countries. China. Definitely. Um, what's another one that's surrounded? Probably like Slovakia. Or Czech Republic. Is it called Czechia now? Um, Romania. Hungary. Hungary has a lot. Damn. Germany. Yeah, DRC. Oh, Democratic Republic of Congo. Most populated countries. Let's chop those off the board. Maybe we'll get some bonuses. Um, China, India, United States, Indonesia, and... Nigeria? Brazil? <laughs> Mexico? Uh, Pakistan? Yeah. Longest rivers? Nile. Amazon. Yanks. How do you spell it? Yank? T Yang's T um how about the M I S S I S S I P P I um is it called the Congo? No, that's not the longest <clears throat> not the longest at all. Um the Vol not the Volga, what's the one in uh Europe. Why am I tripping on that? It's def. Oh, it's not the Danube. Okay. I like. Uh, I don't know what the Yang Zeddy. Oh God. <laughs> I might not get that one. Um, the Colorado. I don't know that one. Okay. Houston. New York. Los Angeles, Chicago, and it's probably pretty obvious, Miami, it's got to be Miami, Dallas, Dallas-Fort Worth, oh, we're halfway done and we're over halfway filled in, largest U.S. states, that should be easy, Texas, Alaska, Montana, Nevada, California, uh, Wyoming. Ooh, what are big ones in the in the middle? Big ones in the middle, like Arizona, New Mexico. Yeah, okay. Um, longest coastline countries. Indo. How is Indo. Oh, it is in there. Okay. Uh, Norway has to be in there. No. New Zealand. It's got lots of islands. 
Chile, you would think. Okay, what else has big coastlines? Like Russia and Canada all across there. Um, I typed in Mexico. Denmark, because of Norway. Er, and because of Greenland. China has a lot. Malaysia has a lot. Oh, New Guinea is the island. Most bordered countries. Oh, man. That's a tough one. There's got to be like one of those little African countries or something in Europe. Maybe it be France. No. Oh, it is. Good. <laughs> Longest coastline countries. I don't know any more rivers. Amazon, Mississippi, Nile, Danube. Um, is there like a Ural River or something? Um, White Nile, is it? Is it that specific? No. Um, maybe there's one in uh, Australia. There's not a lot of water in Australia. That's probably not true. Um, if I wish I knew the Yangtze River. I did that already. Most populous U.S. cities. From New York to L.A. to Chicago. To Houston. To what? Philadelphia? To Philadelphia. To Boston. They're small. They're small. What are big cities? Um, San Fran... Francisco, Francisco, um, what other big cities are there? There's like, um, Minas, St. Paul, Minneapolis, these are not big cities, what are, what are bigger cities? Atlanta, Atlanta. Atlanta's big. What else is big? St. Louis is not that big. Indianapolis. Oh, this is going to suck. Pittsburgh. Oh, it's going to be so obvious, isn't it? It's going to be like right in New York or something. Like one of those stupid things. Newark. Um... Phoenix, so the Chang Chang Yangtze is it, but I couldn't spell it right. The Chang Jiang, the Yenisei. I've never even heard of that river. The Philippines, yeah, it was a really islanded country, but that's pretty good. Ninety percent versus the seventy-six average. Yo yo, what's going on, guys? Just doing some mm -hmm. sporkles. I got a kind of a knack for geography, so just chilling with a beer and doing some quizzes. <laughs> I'm sure it's more fun than this. All right. Hidden neighbors of Argentina. I got to like zoom out for this. This is a a little bit. Okay. Can you find the bordering countries of Argentina? Five and thirty seconds. Uruguay is like down here. Ah. Oh. Brazil. Chile. Bolivia. Paraguay. Oh my god, that's so dumb. Missed the first one. Four letter African country blitz. Can you name all three four-letter countries of Africa in just 30 seconds? <laughs> How many are there? There's only three. Okay, I know one already. Mali. 
<laughs> then, what's that? Oh yeah, Togo. That's a good one. And Chad, the most Chad move. Bingo. Nijen and Banana. The only thing I know about Chad is they're poor as hell and they have a lake that secretes toxic gas and kills people. Great. Great place to be known by. California <laughs> cities. Oh my god. This looks like torture. This is a 10 minute quiz. I'm going to skip that. New quiz. So many. WWE Countdown. <laughs> what? I thought I had geography quizzes on only. <laughs> they went to sports. Geography. Decolorized flags. Pretty decent with flags. 20 flags in 2 minutes and 30 seconds. Can you choose which color should replace the gray on the flag while avoiding the decoys? Interesting. That's green. What do we do? Do we write green? Oh, there it is. Angola is black. Egypt is a gold eagle. Lesotho is like a blue thing. Senegal is a yellow star. Botswana is blue. Somalia is blue. Eswatini has blue stripes, I think. Comoros has a green triangle. Nigeria's green. Tunisia's red. Morocco's got a green star. Ethiopia's got a yellow star. Uganda's got yellow stripes. We're on a roll. Rwanda, I think, is dark green. Kenya's got a red stripe. Namibia. Ooh. Pink is green. Okay. Yeah. That, that makes sense. Malawi's got a red sun. Seychelles is missing yellow. Tanzania's light blue. Bingo. Aces. Got that done in like one minute. Bring it on. What's up, Charles? Hey, Charles. <laughs> uh, geography blitz. Can you name the geography things all beginning with W in two minutes? This is this will be good. A good variety here. Okay, cardinal direction. West. English country. Wales. Oh, what? <laughs> Should it not be? An island. A big, huge island that starts with W. An African capital that starts with W. Disputed Maghreb territory. European capital, Warsaw. Major river. I'm not good at rivers, obviously. The U.S. state, Wyoming. Okay. <laughs> we want Wisconsin. Ooh, Canadian pro your Canadian verbs. Let me put Saskatoon. <laughs> it's W's. <laughs> Got it though. Winnipeg, Australian state, Western, Australia. Oh, um, English County, Wessex. Wait a minute. Really? Wait a minute. Maybe not. Oh, country, country. Oh, county. I see. Yeah, county. Maybe West is Westminster. I don't know anything about England. <laughs> North North American capital. We're riding on board with Kami and Hazma here in the UR2D chat. Mm -hmm. Gonna post this on uh, YouTube after. Um, North American capital. That there should be tons of. Oh God, how dumb. <laughs> World currency. Oh, we've only got 18 seconds. Colored sea, the white sea. National park. Oceanic capital. Chinese sea. 
Sorry? Oh, should have got Wuhan. Get, get you some Worcestershire, Worcestershire, yo, Cubo, what up? Worcestershire. It's. Yeah, I didn't get to those other questions. Didn't uh, didn't get moving fast enough. Wind Cave National Park. Well, Windhoek. That's the capital of Namibia. Damn. All right. E cities by picture. Oh boy. This is going to be real tough. How many cities do I even know with E as the letter? Well, skip that. <clears throat> There's writing on that cliff. That looks like the Louvre pyramids or something. On this Quite a big one. This could be Edmonton. I'm sure Edmonton's going to be one of them. I can't think of any other city with an E right now. East Vancouver. East Vancouver. Honestly, um, how how many other cities can you think of that start with an E? Honestly, I'm good at geography except for bipedal. Except for what? Oh, by picture? By picture. I yeah. Not by picture. If I knew anything with an E, we'd have a hope in hell. Honestly. I'm th I, keep, I keep thinking of es Estonia or something. That could be... Go forward. Go forward. This? That might be Edinburgh. Oh, good one. Oh. Am I oh, am I sounding spelling it right? Yeah, because they have the no, old. You spelled it right. It's just not. A... Michigan State University. Oh my God, this is like really, really specific. That could be Edinburgh. Not this. Edinburgh's not on this. It's very Not this one, but should be on here somewhere. What are other, uh, like, European cities that start with E? Pepsi Max. Look at that. That's an old one. There's some Korean stuff there. It looks like, maybe. With a roof. Okay, one of these has to be Edmonton. I'm not giving up on Edmonton. We're going to have a horrible score here. Ooh, so, like a resort town. I honestly can't think of any That's so hard. Okay, we're cycling through again. This is Edinburgh. Yeah. There it is. That's pretty mm -hmm. distinct. This looks like uh, Cape Town or something. But... Maybe like Southern America. Any Brazilian? Eh... Uh... L, L something, maybe L Salvador's. I know there, uh, there's, a, there's towns in Spain, Elche and Abar. That looks Spanish. I don't know how to spell it. You spelled it, but it's just not. How about Abar? E, E, I, B, A, R. This is gonna stump everybody. This looks like just Middletown America. Um, I'm trying to scan the states. Maybe something in uh, Scandinavia. Estonia. Est I keep thinking Estonia. German Maybe ports. Could be Erfurt, German. Erfurt? 
Erfurt. Oh, Essen. Essen. That's it. Got it. What's the, uh, what's the one that we thought was Edinburgh, the first one? Go to that one. I think that's Erfurt. This place. Have a good night. Cheers. Yeah. No, like the one of the pointy cathedral thing. We already got it was Edinburgh. Or oh, this one? No, no, no. Go, go more. This one. Erfurt. Two Fs? With, no, it's a U. It's E R F U R T. Oh, Erfurt. Good one. Good one. Two minutes. Oh. Mm -hmm -hmm. Egypt City. This one looks pretty distinct. It's got like Turkish or something. I don't know. Some weird kind of. Turkish, maybe Edina? Edina? I N E N E D I N E. No, no, E D I R N E. Edirne. It looks like Turkish or something. They've got Pepsi Max, so they're really with the times. This one it looks like a river more than anything. Don't know. The coastal one will bug me. Because I think it'll be L something. It would really suck if it was East something. El Paso, Texas. Oh! oh that's a good one. That's a real good one. The, these pyramids. This definitely looks Asian or like Singapore or maybe something. They often have like funny architectural displays. I'm gonna give up. Ah, oh, that was Edmonton. I put it for everyone except that one. <laughs> I guess so. Maybe that's their mall. What were the other ones? This was Erie, Pennsylvania. You know what? I thought about typing that, and I was like, no, it's not gonna be in here. Espoo, Finland. Yeah. Looks pretty wet. A lot of mosquitoes. Eindhoven. Never heard of it. Eugene, Oregon. Exeter makes sense. Never would have thought to write that down. Iliad. Again, never. Oh, Hebrew. That's what it was. Evansville, Indiana. One of the most depressing cities in the world in Eastbourne, UK. That does look like a UK beach, doesn't it? Yeah. Like they built resorts, but it's still sad. That's a tough one. Can you name the North and South American countries and capitals that belong to each letter based grab bag category? Oh, whoa, that's confusing. Wait, wait. North and South American countries and capitals. Countries and capitals. Okay, I'm going to do the countries first. Colombia is the Colombia. Costa Rica. Chile. Costa Rica. Canada. Not a not a country. That's not a country. Ends with E. Ends with Y. Ends with E. You forgot an E after the Paraguay. Uruguay yeah. contains it. Venezuela. Now in my erratic typing comes to bite me in the butt. Okay. Um, begins with N. Maybe Brazil. Brazil. Jamaica. Four letters. Um, 
ends with an E. Okay, we got some uh, capitals to look at now. Belize ends with an E. Belize, beautiful. Um, no, 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 no. Begins with an N. There's got to be a capital. Lima. Um, there's a lot to end with an E. Nasa. Santo Domingo. C, C, C. Caracas. Ends with Y. Z. Kingston, Havana. Start start throwing out capitals. Mm. Uh, Port O Spain. Port Louis. Um Would Mexico City kind of Oh definitely. Great grab. Contains a Z L ends with E. Mm. Oh, Guatemala City. Same thing. Oh, that's not how you spell it. And then Panama City. That's cheating. <laughs> Belize, Brazil. Mm. Lima, Quito. No, that's not how you spell it. Bogota. Surname. 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 Ni Nassau, Bahamas. Oh, not doing too bad. There's so many that end with E. Um, Asuncion. La Paz, Brazil, or Bolivia, begins with C, come on, oh, too bad, Dominic Castries, don't know that, oh, yeah, oh, <laughs> got Lima, but not Peru, still crushing the average, though. So that's good. All right, I'll do a couple more. 10 most populous countries in North America. Well, there's not very many. Does it say without getting one wrong? No. Probably will tell you if you get one wrong. Okay, so US and Mexico for sure. Yeah, it'll be in there. One, two, three. Cuba. Yeah. Guatemala, for sure. Um, Dominican Republic, for sure. Panama, you think? Yeah, I think so. Nope. Oh. It's not. No. Um, can you cl can't click on those things? The way. Jama oh, I see. <laughs> what would be in there? Um, Costa Rica. Is Costa Rica more than Panama? No. Oh, they're just outside. El Salvador. Nicaragua. And Honduras was. Oh, Haiti. I'm surprised. Didn't know mm -hmm. Haiti would be there. What? Countries with a country. Oh, damn. Yeah. accepted countries. Oh, God. Wow. Okay. Um. 
<laughs> wow. Um, oh, <clears throat> N. Spell it. It's in three cells and one key. Ah, yeah. It's got to end though. <laughs> oh, damn it. Um, Mali and Malawi. the R. What else? Mm. Tunisia? No, Egypt. Sudan. Djibouti, Eritrea. Somalia. No, that's an O. Oh, oh yeah. It's hard to, to get them all. Less Lesotho, no, is it A or an I? Hate, oh wow, Haiti, no. So countries with an A or an I basically in them. Basically. A or an I. Um, In Bahamas? Bahamas. Right, so that's the North American ones. Asia. Uh, dumb. Sri Lanka. Zambia. What's that? Zambia. Zambia? Gambia. Gambia, yeah. Oh, Gambia and Zambia. Yep, they both work. No, N. <laughs> Chad, Libya, Mal, Magot, Mali. The. What's the one in Asia? Yeah, that's a that's a tough one. Oh. No. No, it has a, yeah, why? Qatar, Kuwait, Bahrain, no, damn it. Iran, Iraq. All the stands are out. <laughs> Korea's gone Japan no it has an N damn it <laughs> okay two minutes we can get this two countries in two minutes Africa what Liberia Cote d'Ivoire Brunei, Rwanda, Botswana, Mozambique. What? Wow, that's a that's out of left field. That's I barely consider that Asia. Really? What are we gonna do? This is this is right there. Not Kenya, <clears throat> Angola, Nanomania, South Africa, Lesotho, Swazi, and 
Oh. Oh, yes, I'm back with Nice. Ooh, let's go. That's a good teamwork, Cubo, with the assists there. Alright, gotta go for one more. Holy crap, 11 minutes? No. Nothing, nothing over 8 minutes, I think. Oh, every time I click random up there, it doesn't stay within the category. And then give up. It's not letting me give up. Oh, there. Okay. Can you name world capitals without the letter I, O, or U? Probably not. <laughs> I don't know capitals that well. I, O, or U, so A's and E's only. Oh, that's this is really tough. <clears throat> Oh, it's got a U. Oh my god. Ooh. Mm -hmm. The African, I don't know any African capitals, very, very few of them anyway. All these oceanic ones, I would not know at all. Um, Sinkios. I just typed it. Oh, okay, I didn't see it. Hmm. Gotta be some good Asian ones. Bang, Bangkok. Jakarta. I <laughs> just typed it too. I'm one step ahead of you. Some po more popular African. Countries. Oh my god. How do you spell that? Is that is that an actual capital? Oh, yeah, I think. Dara. It's the capital of Tanzania. Oh, no, the capital. Oh, yeah. I 
don't know how to spell it though. Dar A. South Africa has like five capitals. Yeah. Time. None of them which Bloom Fountain, Cape Town, Pretoria all have O's. Morocco has Rabat. Oh, you, oh, you already got that. <laughs> I'm running out of ideas already. Jerusalem. Beirut, Damascus, Baghdad. Tehran. What? Oh, it starts with an I. Oh, it's so dumb. I was thinking of all the other ones. Um, man, better, better than I thought. Um, Astana. Oh yeah. No, it's. It's got a weird. Well, it's, it's named Nor-Sultan now. Apparently, Kazakhstan changed the name of its capital. I do remember that. They, like, rebranded their whole country. Is it because of the, like, the Probably more because of Borat. <laughs> uh, because of the president of Kazakhstan, Nor-Sultan, that was his name. He literally named the capital city of the country after himself. Oh, oh that's gross. What's uh, Turkmenistan? Um, uh, I used to know that one. <clears throat> yeah, the capitals are not so fresh on my mind. Tirana. <sighs> I mean, we got almost that. Skjope. Male, Amman. Amsterdam. Oh, that that's one hurts. A lot of these ones I don't really know. Kampala, I didn't know was a... was a capital. Yeah. There's lots. Ashgabat. Yeah. That's, that's Turkmenistan. Oh, damn. Yeah. Chad. Accra. Accra. What's Accra? Yemen. Manama. Caracas. Dakar. Harar. Yeah. Definitely a few of those. I had no chance. Alright. I don't want to go out on a low note. We'll see. What? Five pairs of categorized answers in 30 seconds. Oh yeah, 30 seconds, no problem. Then I gotta go eat. Africa's most populous cities. What, in order? I don't understand. Some of these aren't even saying. Lagos. Lakes of Africa. Lake Victoria. Angola. Deserts. What? This is stupid. Asatini, Namib, Oh, oh, it was really quick, that's why. That's why it was so easy. Do a real one. Oh, God. Can you type the letter for the image which does not relate to the same country as the other three? What? Wait. Can you type the letter 
for the image, which does not relate to the same country as the other three. Okay. So it would be like D for that one. D. <laughs> Oh, England, England, A? April A. Oh, that's Trafalgar Square. <sighs> These are all Russia? Or maybe A? Or A is clear. Wow, okay. Probably B. Meteor rocks? What? Okay. Australian? I know your rocks, man. Rocks. This is definitely Rio. The Pampas. What is that giant thing called? Maybe B's Victoria Falls. Ah, uh, nope. This is really hard. Okay, Paris. Arc de Triumph. Notre Dame Cathedral. And I don't know what A is. Does that make sense? I wish I knew. I wish it would correct what the right the white right choice was. That tower, that's like Korea, isn't it? No, Shanghai, Shanghai Tower, Great Wall of China, Terracotta Army. Yeah, the Terracotta Army. So theoretically, B would not be China. Okay. Oh God. And then D is Notre Dame. That A looks like a German castle. Neuschwanstein. Damn it, it was. <laughs> okay. So is C or D. Tokyo, that's a Tokyo radio tower. C could be, uh, like, yeah, something else. Tibet. <clears throat> okay, so that's Jordan, Syria. No, that's not Jordan. I have no idea. It's like Iraq. Wow, these are so different. D looks like some old castle. What's the odd one out? Dublin Castle, wow. Easter Island is the odd one out. Because that's Machu Picchu and the Nazca Lines in Peru. Ooh. Oh, is this Jerusalem? Put the walls. And then one of those C or B. Don't know what C is. Ah, uh, Babur. Okay. I don't know about C. Don't know what that is. To Taj Mahal could be the odd one out here. If everything else is related to A. A looks like. Yeah, that statue looks like uh, Cambodia or something. I'm gonna say the Taj. C looks like Fatness. I think Taj Mahal might be the odd one out. Oh, it was A.
Maybe this is. This is Jerusalem. Oh shit, yeah. And you could see their caps. Oh, what a way to end it. Alright, log it off.